Hey YouTube, it's Sean Griffin RC Planes. Got a quick one for you. Had a few questions and comments about what is the flight envelope settings, otherwise known as a intermediate mode, inside your AS3X Safe Select receivers, either through forward programming or the 636 receivers through the app or your PC programmer. If you want to win this jet, all you have to do is subscribe, click the notification bell and the like button. Then check back with me from time to time and see my new videos. Once we get to a thousand, we're going to do a drawing. I had a drawing at 100 and only 30% signed up. With those odds, it could be a 1 in 300 chance. Subscribe. Check me out, guys. So, inside receivers that are equipped with uh, AS3X and Safe Select, you can have different uh, flight modes. You know, you could have a flight mode that does nothing zero assistance at all. You can have a flight mode with AS3X only and that is for the wind, stabilization for the wind. And you can also have you know safe select where you can flip a switch and it'll level the plane for you while you're flying. You know you can move the stick all the way over to you know the right and the plane will be turning and then you let off the stick and the plane will level. You can also have a flight envelope mode where you can set how far you want the plane to bank or pitch up and down. So if you move the stick all the way to the right, the plane will only bank to the limit that you decide, you know, as far as it will go. But if you let off the sticks, it will continue to fly at that angle. It won't self-level. So I built a little contraption for one of you guys a few months back, and I'm going to get it out again and put the uh, test plane on it and show you what the flight envelope is. So let me get this little gizmo. Hang tight. My friends over at NASA helped me put this together. I think they used it for the shuttle at one time, but that's discontinued, so they let me borrow it. So we got a little, little gizmo to show our angles right here. And we're gonna call that zero. We're gonna put the test plane on top, and then we can bank the plane from right to left and I've got these red lines right here to show 45 degrees for example if the plane was facing us that'd be a right bank to 45 degrees and then back to you know, around zero degrees so let me throw the plane on here and this all makes sense let's get the plane uh, fired up first get it all initialized all right two separate dances indicates that we have AS3X and safe select the little blue flag is our throttle full throttle no throttle and throttle cut this should be AS3X only I'll spin it around so you guys can see the Control serves us a little better. See the ailerons going up there. The tail going up. If I flip it upside down, safe select is not on. I just turned safe select on. Now you can see the ailerons going crazy. It's trying to right side the plane up. So as of right now, we have safe slick turned on. Let's get out the angle demand tester. That we borrowed from NASA. Alrighty. And we will Spin it around. Right now you can see the AS3X working. Okay. When this wing goes up, so does the green aileron to counteract the gust of wind. See it going up. Alright. Alrighty, angle demand flight envelope. Alright. You can see our ailerons moving there. So I'm going to fully deflect a right hand turn, 
green aileron goes up and I'm gonna hold it in that position with this fancy device I didn't get it from uh, NASA boy we got a cat about to do something mmm all right we're making a right hand turn right we got our flight envelope set at 45 degree bank 45 degrees so we're making our right making our right we're still making our right getting closer to that 45 degrees aren't we getting closer getting closer and we are at the 45 degrees look at the ailerons they are flat the plane won't turn anymore because the ailerons are straight across there's your 45 degrees aileron back up keep watching this green one it's easier to see the planes facing us we're making a right hand turn to the right, 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 and 45 degrees. Our red line is coming down. Let's show our flight envelope at the 45 degree mark for the elevator. All right, elevator up. So, elevator is up, and we're climbing, right? We're climbing. We're climbing, 45 degrees is the max that we have our flight envelope set to. Keep watching the elevator. Getting closer to 45, getting closer to 45, getting closer, almost at 45. There's 45. The elevator is now straight. The plane can't go up any steeper because the elevator is no longer deflected. The elevator is flat just like it is in level flight. All right, well, hey, I hope that helped a few of you out and gave some of you guys a, a little entertainment. So that's all I got for this one. Well, tomorrow is Sunday, and I hope to go fly a little bit, and then uh, well, then, then back, to the, uh, back to the grind, I guess you call it the new normal so anyways hey guys hey thank you so much I appreciate it so subscribe if you haven't and ring the notification bell the notification the notification bell so you don't miss my next video and until next time you'll see me here gotta hit that